Thoughts this morning that a blood test before you get pregnant might help determine the likelihood of your child having autism. Mary Musi has more on that story in today's Long Island Naturally. Jennifer Peters is thinking about getting pregnant. So she's taking prenatal vitamins and she's going for a blood test. Whatever I can do to prepare, it's important. Jennifer's wondering if she has a common gene mutation that could interfere with her body's ability to process folic acid. After all, the Center for Disease Control says inadequate folic acid is linked to birth defects and it's recently been linked to an increased risk of autism. According to Dr. Michael Gritadoria, there's a growing number of studies linking the so-called MTHFR gene to many health issues, including infertility, miscarriage, and autism. This is a key part of the ability to detoxify chemicals in our system. And now there's a direct link between this MTHFR mutation in parents and the potential increase in risk for having a child with autism. Even if you have this gene mutation, the good news is your DNA is not your destiny. There is something you can do about it. You can actually bypass the mutation with nutrition. Dr. Gurdudoria recommends supplements, but warns that the synthetic folic acid found in most prenatal vitamins will not do the trick. Even though all doctors recommend women take folic acid, if you have this mutation, you can't convert folic acid and it's a waste. So it's important that you take the bioactive form called 5-methyl tetrahydrofolate and it's available. It's a no-brainer to, to know and to fix this problem before, before it affects another life. In Huntington, I'm Mary Musi, News 12, Long Island. And you can read more about the folic acid and autism connection by uh, heading to the Long Island Naturally Facebook page. Okay.